is going on, Arkansas Razorback fans, SEC fans everywhere? Welcome. It is the one, the only, Pig Trail Network. I'm its host and creator, Tizilla83. I hope you're doing well. There's a lot of football we could be talking about, a lot of spring football, a lot of stuff there to cover. But in this video, I really wanted to focus on, well, a missed opportunity by the University of Arkansas. So before we get into that, if you guys would, at the end of the video, like, comment, share the content that you just watched and, of course, if you haven't already, feel free to tap the subscribe button down below. Don't forget the notification bell as well. And, of course, as always, go check out those links down below in the description box. You know, there's there's been so much talk about Nolan Richardson and what he deserves or maybe what he doesn't deserve. And I, I have to say that I do believe that he deserves his name on the court. I would even argue that he deserves a statue outside Bud Walton. I'm sure there's some of you who, who disagree, and, and that's fine. Without Nolan Richardson... At the University of Arkansas, you don't have multiple tournament appearances year in and year out. You don't have Sweet 16 appearances. You don't have the Elite Eight appearances or the Final Four appearances or the National Championship appearance or the National Championship trophy. You don't have those things. The banners hanging up inside Bud Walton without Nolan Richardson. Yes, things didn't end the way we would all hope, right? You know, just Nolan Richardson riding off into the sunset. Didn't It didn't end up that way. But you know what? Everything else since then is water under the bridge. It's time to celebrate what Nolan Richardson accomplished. It's time to put his name on the court. It's time to do something. I'm almost positive that there are head coaches across this country on universities that are celebrated a lot more for achieving a lot less than what Nolan was able to achieve at the University of Arkansas. And that, that just can't happen. That cannot happen at the University of Arkansas. Think about Think about the message that that sends. The most successful coach in Arkansas basketball history, and he has a banner, and that's it. I mean, again, a guy that's that's won a national championship, a guy that's that took Arkansas basketball to to new levels of success that they've never seen before and haven't seen since, and and all he has is the banner. Nothing against banners. Banners are great. They show a body of work. But I think I think Nolan deserves quite a bit more than that, if you ask me. That's really all that I have. I, I'm I think they really missed out on an opportunity this weekend, and it's unfortunate. You know, I know that that place was packed, despite Arkansas's losing record, despite this season, you know, not going the way that we all had hoped that it would go. That place was packed to celebrate Nolan Richardson, and I'm sure some of them, probably a lot of them with the expectations of putting Nolan's name on that court. I asked that Hunter Juracek or, you know, if there, are, if there are boosters that are supposedly that we've been told have, have been opposed to this, I, I ask that you make the right decision and celebrate this man's accomplishments. That's all I got, guys. Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch this video. Please share it. Share it on social media, please. I'd like to get this video out, and I would really like for this to reach some boosters or, or maybe Hunter Juracek himself, you know, the chancellor, you know, the, the U of A board, whoever this has to get to. Maybe together we could change some minds and, and get Nolan's name on that court. Or who knows, maybe even a statue. I think it'd be, I think it'd be absolutely wonderful if we, could, if we could get something for Nolan. Uh, to show how much Arkansas fans appreciate what he did for this state, for, for, for the area, and, of course, for the University of Arkansas. So that is going to do it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. You guys be good. Behave yourselves. Have a good week. And go Hogs.